Hey guys, today we thought we'll take you for a little walk through the boat, so let's go. Starting at the bow, you can see both our heat cells are on roller foolers. We do have two cockpits, this one's the front cockpit. While we're sailing, anything to do with the mainsail, whether that's hoisting or reefing, all gets done from this cockpit and we also got another entranceway into the boat from here. And our main sheet track with the main sheet actually feeding back into the aft cockpit. The aft cockpit is our main sailing cockpit. We have all the sheets from the head sails feeding back here. The main sheet and the furling lines all get controlled from here along with running back stays and obviously the helm and all the instruments. So this is really our main cockpit where all the sailing happens from. And it's also the main entrance into the boat. So let's go inside and have a look. Coming down the entrance, we've got the galley to the right and the saloon just opposite the galley. Walking forward on the port side next to the saloon is our master cabin. There's a queen size bed and lots of drawers. We got our own vanity, a toilet and lots of wardrobe space. And of course our own shower. Let's have a look at the galley. Definitely very lucky to have that much space to make it such a big and comfortable area to cook in. Next to the entrance we've got a nav berth which really the off-shift person sleeps in while we're on passage. Next to that we've got one of the aft cabins. This one's our daughter's. She's got a little desk and a little couch and there's a king size single bed with some more drawers underneath. Built into the entry steps is a washing machine which definitely makes my life a lot easier. And across on the port side we got the nav station. And another aft cabin, which this one is our son's, but is basically identical to the starboard aft cabin. Heading forward past the galley, there's a large queen size couch on the starboard side. And just opposite is the engine, a tool room, and access to the generator as well. The same access is also in the master cabin on the other side. And as you can see with the hatches removed you got pretty good access to any part of the engine or gearbox and makes generally working on the engine that much easier. Continuing on forward, there's a toilet and a shower. Mm -hmm. 
and another separate toilet. There's also an extra freezer and there's also an extra single berth slash couch. Opposite from there we've got a separate cabin. It's got a little seat in it and a generous double bed and some drawer space underneath. And we got another forward cabin with a pretty generous sized double bed and drawer space underneath. That cabin also has access to our toy room. Lots of surfboards and kite boards and kites and paddle boards and all those toys you got to have. And forward from there is our anchor locker and a little crash compartment as well right up in the bow. And a big hatch to give us perfect access from the deck. As you can see the cabin's also got a single bunk slash couch which makes it quite a spacious cabin really. And that's it from the boat tour. I hope you guys enjoyed it and thanks a lot for watching.